Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today we'll be taking a look at some of the fastest single engine turboprop civilian airplanes. We also did a video on the fastest single engine military airplanes. If you're interested in that, it will be linked below. Now let's get started. Coming in at number five, we have the Piper M600 SLS. In 2015, Piper introduced the M600 as an upgrade to the M500. It received its FAA certification on June 18th, 2016. Between June 2016 and March 2018, 50 were delivered, mostly in the US, and most were owner flown. When Piper introduced the M600, they exceeded industry expectations for performance and operational ease in a single engine pressurized turboprop. A clean sheet designed wing was a key foundational enhancement that paved the way for the product's growth. Now, they're using that platform to raise the bar in safety, luxury, and support. Introducing the M600 SLS, setting new standards for aircraft in every category and meeting the highest standard in general aviation. It can hold up to five passengers. The M600 has a unit cost of US $3.189 million dollars with a max cruise speed of 274 knots the Piper M600 has a basic operating weight of 3,650 pounds a max takeoff weight of 6,000 pounds and a full fuel payload of 658 pounds the Piper M600 has a max operating altitude of 30,000 feet and a max rate of climb while being fully loaded of 1,556 feet per minute. The Piper M600 can fly a range of 1,658 nautical miles with 45 minute reserves when flying at 184 knots. But even at a faster 274 knots, it can fly 1,209 nautical miles. The landing distance for the Piper M600 is 2,659 feet, but that includes a 50 foot obstacle the Piper M600 is powered by a Pratt & Whitney PT6A-42A engine model with a power rating of 600 shaft horsepower. At number 4, we have the Pilatus PC12 NGX. The Pilatus PC12 is a single engine turboprop passenger and cargo aircraft manufactured by Pilatus Aircraft of Switzerland. The main market for the aircraft is corporate transport and regional airline operators. The PC-12 is the best-selling pressurized single-engine turbine-powered aircraft in the world. The cabins of the PC-12 around the world are partly inspired by the famous car manufacturer BMW. Pilatus says together with BMW Design Works, we are pleased to offer the most comfortable and modern cabin experience ever in the PC-12 NGX which is too inspired by Pilatus' own business jet, the PC-24. The PC-12 NGX has many configurations, holding up to 10 passengers. The base price of the PC-12 NGX in 2020 is $4,390,000. But if you want an executive configured aircraft, it's priced at $5,369,000 with a max cruise speed of 290 knots. The PC-12 has a basic operating weight of 6,803 pounds, a max takeoff weight of 10,450 pounds, and a useful load of 3,647 pounds. The PC-12 NGX has a max operating altitude of 30,000 feet and a max rate of climb of 1,920 feet per minute. The PC-12 also has a max range of 1,803 nautical miles and it only requires 2,485 feet of runway to take off and 2,170 feet of runway to land. The PC-12 NGX is powered by the Pratt & Whitney PT6E-67XP engine model with a power rating of 1,200 shaft horsepower. Next at number three is the Evolution Turbine. The Evolution is an American pressurized low wing four place single engine light aircraft made from carbon fiber composite developed by Lanclair, which is supplied as an amateur built kit by Evolution Aircraft. The Evolution can be powered by a Lycoming piston engine or a Pratt & Whitney PT6 engine. It came in third place because the aircraft has several engine options. 
That's the EV OT550 with a 550 shaft horsepower turbine engine with 265 knot cruise. Then there's the EV OT750, which has a 750 shaft horsepower turbine engine with a 300 knot cruise. But then there's the EV OT850, which is powered by the Pratt & Whitney PT6-1408, 867 shaft horsepower turbine engine with a max cruise speed of 330 knots. The EVOT850 has a cost of about 1.5 million US dollars, a maximum range of 1,287 nautical miles with IFR reserves. It has a max operating altitude of 28,000 feet and a payload of 800 pounds. Coming in at number two, we have the TVM940. The TVM is a high performance single engine turboprop light business and utility aircraft. The TVM 940 offers the ultimate developments in avionics and comfort for a general aviation aircraft. As an evolution of the TVM 900 and of the TVM 930, the TVM 940 retains its airframe commonality with its predecessors, incorporating a variety of aluminum and steel alloys, titanium, as well as advanced composite materials. The TVM airframe offers unmatched structural strength and durability at its lowest possible weight. From its inception, the TVM aircraft family employed a fail-safe airframe design, including the use of multiple load paths, a crack stopper band, and an optimized number of access panels to maximize structural life and subsystem reliability while also minimizing repair cycle times. All this while opening a new era by offering an enhanced human-machine interface environment for pilots and providing more comfort to its passengers. The TBM 940 can hold up to six passengers. It has a cost of about 4.3 million US dollars with a max cruise speed of 330 knots. The TBM 940 has a basic operating weight of 4,629 pounds, a max takeoff weight of 7,394 pounds, and a full fuel payload of 891 pounds. The TBM 940 has a max operating altitude of 31,000 feet and advertises the ability to reach that altitude in 18 minutes. The TBM has a max range of 1,730 nautical miles when flying at 252 knots at 31,000 feet. But even at a faster 326 knots, it can fly 1,440 nautical miles based on one pilot and 45 minute fuel reserves. This aircraft needs about 2,380 feet to take off and 2,430 feet to land, but that includes a 50-foot obstacle. The TBM 940 is powered by the Pratt & Whitney PT6A-66D engine model with a power rating of 850 shaft horsepower. And in the number one place, we have the Epic E1000GX. The now FAA certified Epic E1000GX is an American single engine six seat turboprop light aircraft developed by Epic Aircraft of Bend, Oregon. Epic's plan was that the Epic E1000GX would be the fastest single engine civil aircraft at the time of its introduction. On Epic Aircraft's official website, this is how they describe the aircraft. From urban city center to remote backcountry strips, the versatile E1000 provides access to more airports than any other aircraft in its class, with speed, performance, superior short field and slow handling capabilities, trailing link landing gear, and full reversing prop. Epic expands your horizon from the concrete jungle to the tropical jungle and beyond. The Epic E1000GX has a cost of about 3.85 million US dollars with a max cruise speed of 333 knots. The Epic E1000 has a max takeoff weight of 8,000 pounds and a full fuel payload of 1,100 pounds. And the Epic E1000GX is not just the fastest on this list, but it can also fly the highest and climb the fastest. It has a max operating altitude of 34,000 feet and it can climb at an impressive rate of 4,000 feet per minute. The Epic E1000GX has a range of 1,385 nautical miles when flying at 325 knots at 34,000 feet. 
but at a slower 265 knots, it can fly 1,650 nautical miles. This aircraft only needs 2,254 feet of runway to take off and 2,399 feet to land, but that also includes a 50 foot obstacle. The Epic E1000 GX is powered by the Pratt & Whitney PT6A-678 engine model with a power rating of 1200 shaft horsepower. And that concludes our list. If you want to see the military version of this video, it will be linked below. What similarities did you notice when watching this video? What's your favorite out of the bunch? Let me know down in the comment section. And if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And if you want to see more content like this, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell button to get notifications when I upload a new video. That's all for this video. It's Ramal in the Aviator, and I'm out.